guys, Josh here. This is actually a review. Uh, I'm going to try to keep this short. I, had, I just shot another review on this thing and it just got long, really drawn out. So we're going to try to keep this short. This is on the Harbor Freight propane torch, the one with the three burners. Obviously you can see it in the picture. I think it's self-explanatory. Self Item nine, number 91899. So I was in the market for a medium size propane torch. I was start off with one of these little cheapos from Home, from home Depot. Uh, it doesn't throw that much heat. It's good enough for you know half inch you know copper uh, line that you're trying to sweat. Um, I then actually from work somebody gave me this. It's the it's an old Burns-O-Matic JT 680 or no 650. Uh, I believe that's a model just before 680. 680 is the current one, but this is the older one. 650 puts out a nice ni nice flame, nice nozzle. Uh, you could def definitely see there, these are very similarly sized. So, now, what I got in the box was, of course, the three nozzles, the three burners, plus a little wand. But this thing comes in this uh, very cheap plastic case. Yeah, just one of them clamshell ones. Odds are the hinge is going to break in probably about a year or maybe three times of opening this thing. But the uh, thing has its own cutouts in here. I don't know why there's a cutout for something else, but whatever the hell that is. Oh, is that supposed to be the propane bottle? Are you serious? Little shorty propane bottle supposed to fit in there. That's uh, pretty sad, actually. Whatever. But yeah, you could uh, tear that out and put your propane bottle in there. Wow, that's gonna be a tiny bit bottle. Anyways, so you guys get the point of the box. That's not what I'm here to show you. We have these three nozzles. Oh, these are still warm from the previous video. So you got these three nozzles. This one actually puts out a very nice fan flame. It's actually pretty intense still. It's uh, these things. I, I was afraid this was going to be a really crappy flame burn, uh, but it actually throws out a nice flame on it. This guy, this just looks like an evil dragon's you know breath. Uh, it actually shoots fire from all directions, you know, up, down, pretty much everywhere except for flame coming in at the mouth. But uh, yeah, it fires out everywhere. It's uh, obviously these things meant for heating up, you know, pipe and stuff like that. Did I read the instructions on this? Heck no. Why would I want to do a thing like that? There's no danger in reading instructions. Uh, this, I would actually assume that it's just a wand that clamps onto the tip of this. Um, yeah, I don't know. Maybe you want to pretend you're like Ripley from uh, Aliens or something. You know, got that little crazy uh, blowtorch burner on there. You have whatever. All right, let's not get sidetracked. Now this hooks onto a standard small bottle. Um, yeah, it just screws right on. It's got two shutoff valves. So obviously this is the master valve off the tank. Then you got your secondary and your wand. There's no built-in igniter. So obviously you're going to need to get yourself a striker or something. You know, something to give yourself, uh, get this thing lit up. Now, turn bottle's turned on. It starts off nice. Nice flame on this thing. A real nice flame, actually. Look at that beauty. So the flame is throwing out is a good. Jeez, it's shooting out about uh, three inches past that brick. So this thing really throws out a good, you know, what is that, nine inches? You know, almost a foot long flame on this thing. But, again, I'm going to try to keep this short. I'll put my glove on so I can take that off because it's probably going to be warm. Let's get these other nozzles put on. They do give you, there is a little bit of a built-in uh, oxygen, uh, I don't know, cover? I don't know, what, what the heck would you call that thing? Um, but I don't see why you would need that. Obviously, I would want to have heat up with, you know, maximum heat with this thing. So if you choked it down, it basically just makes the flame weaker, more of a, you know, feather-like, if you want to call it that. All right. Look that fan flame. Nice. Yeah, if you go three, three fingers wide, now this thing is really coming from here to here. Nice flame on that thing. Okay. Let's go final. Try to get this in frame if I could help that.
pretty mean looking little thing. Yeah, it's throwing a flame in all directions, so this thing's definitely meant to heat up some type of pipe. Obviously, if I um, set a pipe in there, that's what she's designed to do. All right, let's set that down here. Again, guys, this is just a trying to do a short video. I wanted to show you guys what this thing does, how it operates, what it does. I was in the market myself. I actually went to the Harbor Freight this morning to basically just kind of hunt for something else, but I came across this. Figured, you know what? Let's do it. Uh, I was curious. I was gonna. I was interested in buying this until somebody gave me this one. And yeah, it was a freebie. But again, gas gets starting to go. You know that kind of stuff. And I figured, you know what? There were no videos on YouTube on this one. Nothing. Um, I think I'm the first to show this one. So guys, please uh, thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe. Give me a thumbs up if you like the video. Uh, if you don't, give me thumbs down. I don't give a damn. Obviously, it's you know, you guys tell me what you like. If I'm doing something wrong, let me know. Oh, Jesus. But it is what it is. Guys, I really do appreciate you watching them. Thank you very much. Later.